papers, pagers, laptops, iPods, Twitters, whatever's going to be on you. Good? Okay. So, um, it's my pleasure to introduce you to the comedic stylings of David Haig. So somebody came up to me and they said to me, you know, the great thing about coming tonight is that if you're funny, I'm going to laugh, but if you bomb, I'm probably going to laugh even harder. It's for your own good. You hit me! It's for your own good. Get him. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, sorry, we just had a bit of a technical malfunction. It is my pleasure to introduce you to David Haig. Oh. Good evening, Mrs. Saga. I'm, uh, I'm glad to be here. I gotta tell you, though, they say that in the human experience, the most stressful event in anyone's life is bearing children. But they say that the second most stressful thing in anyone's life is public speaking. And I gotta be honest with you, right now, I'm not sure that's true. Because the idea, the idea of giving birth to a 10-pound baby right now is looking pretty good to me. But we're here tonight, we're here tonight to examine funny business. And funny business is that magical area that exists between comedy and business. And in comedy and in business you'll find that really they're one and the same. The only thing that changes them around is the presentation. So what you need to remember is that it's all in the presentation. I kind of think to yourself, when you come into an auditorium like this and you see one of these stools, well, you know you're going to hear some comedy. But on the other hand, if you come in and all you see is one of these big lecterns, well, you know it's going to be strictly business. Well, we're going to spend some time on the comedy side, and we're going to spend some time on the lectern side, but in reality, we're going to spend a lot of time in the middle. And that area between comedy and business is called spin. And spin is what allows our society to, to stay sane. Spin is what allows politicians not to lie to us, but to mis misspeak to us. Spin is that magical area that turns fact into fiction, fantasy into reality. Spin is what allows bankers all around the world to lose trillions and trillions of dollars, to lose trillions of dollars and bring about a complete collapse of the financial system, yet still say to themselves that they deserve billions of dollars in bonuses. <laughs> now let's Let's examine that for, let's just look at that a little deeper. On Wall Street right now, the bankers are telling us that they have to pay these bonuses to keep their good people. Well, let me think about that. Let's just say, if everyone can imagine, let's just say that for the last 10 years we had, uh, oh, I don't know, let's say we had Curious George and Bozo the Clown running Wall Street. Let's think about that. Over the last 10 years, what's the absolute worst that Curious George and Bozo could have done? Well, the absolute worst that they could have done will be to lose trillions of dollars and bring the financial system to the verge of collapse. So here's a bit of a, here's a, bit of a news flash. When your bank loses trillions of dollars and brings the world to the edge of economic collapse, you don't have any good people working for you. <laughs> <laughs> 